Yeah, it's really enjoyable, mate. Um, obviously got a lot of good players in and around me, so my job's pretty easy out there on the wing at the minute. Um, but yeah, it's been really pleasing, the combination we've built in the last last few weeks. So yeah, I'm really enjoying my footy at the minute. Yeah, it felt good, uh, you know, especially that first half. <laughs> um, had quite a lot of touches and yeah, look, it's, like I said, it's just good that the players I play inside of me are giving me the ball in space, so that's where I want it and um, yeah, enjoyed it. Yeah, it feels really good. I think it was always going to take a little bit of time, obviously. I had a bit of a disruptive pre-season and, you know, combinations take a bit of time to build. But, you know, it's, it's good that the, the building now, the flourishing and, yeah, like I said, just really enjoying it. Yeah, he's looking all good, obviously. It's good to have him back as well, you know, what he brings to the team. So, yeah, it's looking good. Yeah, it'll be massive to have him back. Um, obviously, he's a great player, and you know we've got a lot of players in the team that like playing in them big games. So I'm pretty sure everyone's looking forward to, you know, the test this weekend. Um, so yeah, we all can't wait. What do you make of the Sharks? I think there were a few people expecting you to perform over against Melbourne, one of their first big tests, but they got over the line without Nico as well. Um, sort of show that they are perhaps you know, building for something special as well. Yeah, definitely. I think. You know, they only lost like one game is it this, this all year. Um, you know, it's pretty impressive and we've got a big job on our hands this week to try and stop them. But um, yeah, look, like I said, we all enjoyed playing in the big games and I think we're up, up to the job, so. Yeah, definitely. Um, you know, especially with my game the last few weeks as well. I think I'm finally finding my feet at the club, starting to build them combinations and, you know, just get more familiar with everything that's going on. So, yeah, I feel like I'm, I'm building nicely into, you know, into the middle part of the season and, you know, it's all about finishing strong now. In your own game, like you mentioned at the very start, you know, like some of the guys just get players alongside you. Did that take time to get used to? Yeah, I think it does just because, you know, some of the guys are, are so talented, you kind of don't know what they're, they're going to do all the time. And I think it, it just takes, you know, games with them to kind of understand and learn, you know, what, it works for them and what you know when the opportunities are going to come so yeah it's been it's been a bit of a learning period and I'm just happy that it's all you know coming together now <laughs> um I don't, I don't really find it too daunting to be honest you know I'm pretty confident in my own ability and I know what I'm good at as well so I kind of just thought it was more exciting that they can unlock the tools that I bring to the team as well and you know it's me helping them out and repaying them as well so that's kind of the way I looked at it yeah, 100. percent I feel like you know when we're on, you know everything just happens so quick. We can really punish teams quickly, um, which is obviously a really good thing. And yeah, probably all of them touched in the first half. Probably not had a start to the game like that yet, but um, yeah, it was really enjoyable. Yeah, I think my whole that whole edge, you know, is pretty, the very unpredictable. Obviously, Joey, you know, he's got the quick pass, gave me the try on the weekend. You know, he's very unpredictable. You got Sammy there. You never know what he's going to do. He's, you know, just an instinctive player. So, yeah, it take, takes a bit of time. But um, look, I, I'm lo loving playing it outside them guys, and yeah, I'm benefiting from it. So. Yeah, I guess a little bit. I'm kind of used to just people giving me the ball and letting me do all the work, but um, they're making everything a bit easier for me, so, you know, it's only a good thing. Dom, uh, a couple of miles ago this week, uh, yep. 250, 250 games. Uh, you know, you've been here for a short time, but what have you sort of learned from here? Sort of giving you any tips and you've gotten to know him a bit? Yeah, definitely. I think um, I've obviously watched Toots for a lot of years now, so coming to the club, I was definitely, you know, looking forward to kind of learning off him. Um, you know, he's been one of the benchmark wingers in the comp for however many years now. So, you know, he's been good with me. He's given me, you know, quite a few tips. And yeah, look, it's just that me trying to learn off him. And, you know, he's got a lot of wisdom to kind of pass on to me. So I'm sure all the boys will want to be, put in a big performance for him.
yeah, he's been really good to play with as well. You know, he leads from the front. Um, he's always in the picture. He's always there for you. So, you know, he's, he's a player that you want to play with as his two. So, you know, we'll definitely be wanting to, to put in a big shift for them boys. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think we're you know we're looking too far into the to the future. I think we, it was all about our you know playing our style of footy and you know getting up to speed with that. I think when we're at our best, you know we feel like we can we can really beat any team. And as long as we're playing our best consistently, you know more focus on ourselves and not look too far ahead. But um, you know I'm sure then conversations might come about a bit later on.